I am the youth of today by Lovella Chris L. Palma I am the youth of today I am a descendant of the brave Katipuneros and the strong-willed leaders of the revolution I wear the red banner and carry the torch of my guerrilla forefathers. The blood of my ancestors runs through my veins. I was not delivered into this world in defeat. The resilience of the past centuries nourishes my will, but I am still fighting for my freedom, justice, and peace. To our distinguished members of the Board of Judges, to my fellow contenders, friends, visitors, ladies and gentlemen, good afternoon. I stand before you to speak for democracy that our heroes died for, the unfortunate and unjust strive for, and the present and even the future generations and the world. Honor and dignity flow in my blood and my heart beats for freedom. Ladies and gentlemen, the Filipino heroism is our legacy. It is found in the determination that made it possible for our Panganhon brothers to fight for freedom. It is in the courage that sustained them to seek justice for the brutal Bangan massacre many years ago. Let the blood of the courageous Katipuneros run through the veins of our children. Let their cries be echoed to our youth. Let us revel in the victory and peace that our forefathers gave their life for. But where is our freedom? Through the agony of the 300 of years under Spanish colonization, fellow several Bananhoods, years under the Japanese and American the Filipino youth of today. I should think I we enjoy are the social networking like Facebook and Instagram. But a I fellow like Filipino 
Filipino dictator wants to get once online. again threaten our was I do online when victory became ours the city of democracy in our country thoughts begun to always take contain memories and sprouted meaningful virtues I our should rejoice and shout down to us However, it is my ladies and gentlemen in the stories that I can I see pictures of the motherland and reality at the present of how we and came she is changed. It is in Her my actions are the body of poverty of nature and of inequality. Healthy Her changes are those of injustices, human rights violations, corruption, and prison. Her eyes are blinded by media and social networking. But her heart breaks as she sees her sons point their guns at each other. She sees her daughters slaving their way in foreign lands to earn money to buy food for their families. Is this what freedom has cost her? I am the youth of today. I am free to do what I want without prejudice. I am free to say what I want without fear of incrimination. I have grown funds of TV shows, love things, and teleseries, and fight over them in social media. If only my fellow youths can defend our land from domestic terrorist groups, like how we defend Alda or Pastilla's girl. If only we can protect our West Philippine Sea from foreign invaders, like how we protect our love teams from rumors. Then 